Thank you for joining us to learn about the MMPS Countdown to Kindergarten website. I'm Phyllis Phillips, the MMPS Early Learning Department Director. Today we will provide information on the MMPS Countdown to Kindergarten website, which provides resources and activities to help families get ready for kindergarten. Today, we will give an overview on the Countdown to Kindergarten website, review the features of the website, and provide an opportunity for families to ask questions about the website. The Countdown to Kindergarten website is integrated into the MMPS Early Learning website. This website's content was created by MMPS with the support of various community partners who focus on early education. The content supports the Tennessee Early Learning Developmental Standards, also known as 10Ls. The website was created to support families enrolled in an MMPS pre-K program who are entering kindergarten, as well as families that may be attending other pre-K programs a private daycare provider, or families who are not currently in a program who need additional supports for their child's transition to kindergarten. There is also content on the website to support early learning educators at private daycare programs. All information, activities, and resources on the website are free for families. Most of the content on the website is available in multiple languages. At the top of the website, families can change the website content to their preferred language. Now let's look at the features on the MMPS Countdown to Kindergarten website. At the top is the website address to the MMPS Early Learning website. Below the website address are screenshots of the actual website. There is also a QR code on the top right hand corner. QR codes provide direct links to information. To view a QR code, open the camera app on your smartphone device and hold your device so the QR code appears in the viewfinder and you will see a notification with a link. Open the notification to access the web link associated with the QR code. When families visit the MMPS Early Learning website, the Countdown to Kindergarten website can be found in the top header bar. When you click on the Countdown to Kindergarten heading you, header, you can view the content we will be reviewing today. Under the Kindergarten Readiness section, we provide information and activities in key areas that support a child's development as they enter kindergarten. The key areas are early literacy skills, early math skills, early STEM skills, gross motor skills, and social emotional learning. We encourage families to explore this information to learn about ways to support their child's development in these critical areas. Each section contains information, tips, and activities for families. Now let's explore one of the key areas, early literacy. This area provides information on what is early literacy, as well as tips on reading with your child. There is also a list of pre-K recommended literature for families. Each book recommended has an activity sheet to support at-home learning. The activity sheets can be downloaded. The books can be found at your local library or online. We have included a version for parents and families to use at home, and we also have a version for teachers to use in schools. Teachers can download activity and guide sheets through the teacher resources section of this website. Another key area for families to explore is the family resource section. 
In this section, families will find quick links to local, state, and national parent and family resources to further prepare their child for kindergarten. The web links are divided into three areas, literacy and learning resources, healthy children resources, child care resources. Under literacy, there are recommended web links to Kids Central Tennessee, Nashville Public Library, and other resources for families to access. If a family scrolls further down under the Family Resources section, there is a Tools section. These tools are different activities to support learning at home. There is a monthly kindergarten readiness activity calendar that provides activities families can do at home. Our summer months on the calendar also have links to videos that walk families through the activity. Families will also find the monthly MMPS Kindergarten Readiness Newsletter. This newsletter is provided to families participating in the MMPS Pre-K program. Each newsletter provides tips, a book recommendation, and activities to help get families ready for kindergarten. An additional tool is the MMPS Summer Activity Guide. The digital guide is available in English, Spanish, and Arabic, and is a 28-page guide that includes activities to support summer learning. The activities support key development areas such as literacy, math, and social-emotional learning. Here's a sample of one of the guide's pages, which shows families' fun and different ways to paint at home. Throughout the guide, the blue boxes indicate recommended books that support the activity on the page. Under the Family Resources section, there are Learning at Home lessons, which are over 35 lessons that mirror concepts taught in an MMPS pre-K classroom. The lessons are centered on a book and available in English, Spanish, and Arabic. The lessons are segmented into four areas. Unit one, all about me. Unit two, my community. Unit three, awesome animals. Unit four, ready for kindergarten. Here's a sample from our all about me lessons. Most lessons are about 15 minutes long. Lessons include an activity and activity steps, guided questions, and a follow-up activity. Families can complete one lesson a week within each unit, choose to divide the lesson over multiple days, or repeat parts or all of the lessons. Most materials for the lessons can be found at home, and books are available through your local library, or sometimes families can find the read alouds online. The internet is a large space, and sometimes as you navigate, you find areas that are not kid friendly. Working with community partners, we created a list of fun, safe websites for children to explore. In the Fun for Kids section, we created a list of those websites. We still recommend monitoring your child as they use these websites or any websites. Now we are going to open the Q&A box. Please submit your questions by using the Q&A icon at the top of the screen. I will give you a few minutes for anyone who has a question to type their question in the Q&A.
OK, I have one question in the Q&A right now, and I'll read that aloud. How can I find what pre-K program my, my assigned school provides? Uh, for example, we're assigned to Gower, but how do we know whether it's a Montessori program or a learning center? Can we apply for a different nearby site or school that has Montessori? That's a great question. So we do have only two Montessori sites, and that is Hull Jackson and Stanford. Those are the only two school sites that provide Montessori uh, style uh, approach to learning. We have four early learning centers, and that is Cambridge Early Learning Center, Casa Azafran Early Learning Center, Ross Early Learning Center, and Ivanetta Davis Early Learning Center. Those are our only four early learning centers. All other schools, uh, all other programs that are located in school sites, those are school based programs. I will I will say that all school based and early learning centers use the same curriculum, which is creative curriculum. However, the Montessori programs use the uh, Maria Montessori approach to learning. Families can apply for different nearby sites and school sites, uh, whether it is a Montessori site or a uh, school based site. Families are open to apply for any pre K program. Thank you for that question. I'll wait a few minutes for other questions. Keep in mind that today there are other breakout sessions that you can attend and the next one starts at 445. You will also be able to uh, access the recordings of the other sessions that you were unable to attend. I want to thank everyone for joining us for today's call. If you have any additional questions about the Countdown to Kindergarten website, please contact us using the early learners email address on the screen. I will answer this question that just popped up. Will we get to meet our child's teacher before the first day of school? So this varies uh, according to school sites. Some school sites have events prior to the opening of school. Some school sites send out letters to their families to welcome them to their school, and uh, some uh, send out emails. So it varies according uh, per school, so you probably would be best to contact the school that your child uh, was selected to attend, and they will um, be happy to share what their school's protocol is. If you have general questions about MMPS, please contact the Family Information Center. We recommend keeping that phone number throughout your child's academic career in MMPS. Also, the QR code on the screen goes directly to the Countdown to Kindergarten website. We hope the Countdown to Kindergarten website is a resource for your family to support your child's transition to kindergarten. Thank you for attending.